That's so pretty. Number two, I said those outfits are la 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 la. <laughs> so tell us where you're from. Um, I'm from Miami. Miami. Mm -hmm. yeah. You look naked parents. I know. I know. Bad Spanish is <laughs> I know. following you. It's I know. like it's a it's a big question mark. <laughs> <laughs> 
And you're also from Miami? And I'm actually from Washington, D.C. Wow. But my parents are from El Salvador, and I'm married to her brother. <laughs> <laughs> I should have known that was family somewhere. You all were hanging too tight. <laughs> She's like the sister I never had. I know. Oh my God. So you mean you only no sisters, only brothers, yeah. solo? Yeah. Oh no. Then the universe said, "Here she is. She's perfect." <laughs> you took her and ran. I like you all. She just, she just also, you know, inherited an amazing sister. All right. 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 Thank you so much for being on the vlog with me today. I appreciate you both. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Hello, everyone. Okay, so I am pleasantly full, and I see why I chose Joy to come and visit today for um, lunch or brunch. Um, my my soul, mi alma, was telling me, was guiding me here. And I thought I wanted to go to the um, uh, pizza place, but I really didn't. I just wanted to patronize the, the place because of the uh, owner that I met with, um, with, uh, with uh, Agua. But yeah, I went to, um, I went to Joy because, <laughs> <laughs> because <laughs> Adios Tener un gran día So um, I wanted to patronize The pizza place Because of the the lady That was there the, I think they, she's the, uh, Agua said the lady owned it Y'all see my head Y'all see my head I love my head Anyway Anyway so, um, um, <laughs> um, um, I'm just, I'm just arming, arming, arming. But, um, so, mi regalo de el universo aquí um, was to go into Joy and meet Mia, her sister, in, her sister-in-law, and to say goodbye to Carla and give her the gift from, that I wanted to give her the first day that I went into the restaurant when I had lunch there the other day. So, um, what, uh, what, <laughs> hello, hello, oh. So, anyway, um, uh, so, um, Oh my gosh, uh, I am so happy. So I talked to Mia and I put her on my vlog and uh, Hola a todo, todo el mundo. ¿Cómo, cómo están ustedes? Bien, bien. Ay, tener un gran día. So, um, so, um, so, um, so I love these people. Amo la gente aquí. Um, anyway, I met Mia and her sister and they were beautiful. And I noticed them right away. And I was sitting in my window seat in joy. And I was thinking, oh, I'm just sitting here watching the world go by. And, and then Mia walked by and she had on the prettiest little floral outfit and then her sister-in-law walked by and she had on a pretty floral outfit and I was like oh isn't that lovely they're beautiful in um, island attire like peacocks and, and um, the universe had them to sit right behind me right behind me and I'm thinking oh my gosh and so they are speaking absolutely beautiful Spanish beautiful so they're speaking this gorgeous Spanish and I'm thinking to myself wow they look like Americans they might still be Americans but I admire the way they are speaking the language so um, 
somehow it ended up I finished my my fruit bowl and then I turned around and Mia said I'm sorry we're not we're not like just looking at you or something we're just kind of looking outside and and I was like it's okay um, uh, and and I just started laughing and talking with her and it was more than okay because she was the friendliest beautiful eyes um, and, and her sister-in-law was just as beautiful and they started speaking to me and talking to me. Like, you know, just wonderful. Let me make sure I have my cell phone in this bag. See? Lo tengo aquí en mi bolso. So anyway, we're just talking and then and, and we're talking and then I think to myself I would love to have them on my travel vlog so I gave them I put up my vlogging camera no I think the sister asked me what um, what was my camera and I was telling you know what type of camera did I had did I have and um, I was telling her that it was a vlogging camera so we were talking a little bit more and it was just great because that led to uh, easy natural um, conversations and then we got to Mia um, is a traveler and she's been all over and her sister also and oh my goodness and you can't imagine this guys but I'm gonna tell you serendipity of the universe this is how it works with spirit Mia has been throughout Thailand and her sister-in-law married to uh, her sister married to Mia's brother they've been throughout Thailand so oh my gosh that is where I want to go um, next if not next it's really where I want to go uh, very very soon oh my goodness they have been there and then Mia started telling me the various places that I can go in Thailand oh I am fascinated with that because I see my favorite YouTubers, um, Wendy and um, her fiance, Wendy Jones, her Wendy's Curls channel, she and her fiance, um, Hennessy, I think his name is. <laughs> they just went to uh, Thailand, maybe not just, but they've been to Thailand. And so I saw all the gorgeous clips and, and the footage and oh my goodness, I said, I'm going to Thailand, even if I have to go by myself. And oh, Mia and her sister have been there. That is the universe's way of telling me, go Claudia, go. It's gonna be wonderful. Pack your bags and go again. And the universe is telling me, and you may not have to go by yourself. You may pick up friends along the way and they will go with you. And Mia is in Nashville. I would love to go to Nashville and visit Mia and vlog there. Likewise, I would love to have Mia come to Atlanta and enjoy Atlanta with me and my family and my sisters. That would be so wonderful. I, I'm enchanted with the way it all works here when you live in the fifth dimension. And you might say, well, what in the world is she talking about now, the fifth dimension? is that dimension that's all the coconut that I had <laughs> in my uh, fruit bowl and I've got to remember to make a fruit bowl for myself um, uh, when I get home but what what where the fifth where is the fifth dimension the fifth dimension is beyond the third dimension that we can see in as far as depth and scope and what we see on the full surface of our whole reality now and the fourth dimension is to be able to look beyond this and the and see something else and the fifth dimension is to know that um, it is a place of love hello baby hi oh my goodness hi hi how are you I have a little friend hey <laughs> so the fifth dimension is when you live in a dimension where fear is not 
predominant in your life and it doesn't hold you in one spot. <clears throat> you live in a dimension in the fifth world here on a plane of love. And so you know that for what you want to do, you are loved and protected to go on and do that no matter what happens in your experience. That you can stop, visualize the reality that you want to create in your life and it happens because you trust that power within to bring you all of the people, places and things that you need to make that a reality. Oh gosh, thanks for being with me here on the island. As I was telling Mia, no, I didn't get a chance to see a wide swatch of the island. I did, however, get to know a block, uh, not a block, a corner. Uh, and it was, I bet, a microcosm of what is here in the Dominican and what it has to offer. And Mia said, oh my God, I like your Spanish. You speak like the Dominicans. And so I, I love that because I've been working on my language skills and, and, not, um, and I have not been bowing to the fear of being wrong because when someone stops to correct you, no matter how they correct you in speaking a language, it is your blessing. Es tu regalo for their instruction. Um, es, es, es tu regalo um, por este instrucciones. Por, por los instrucciones uh, desde de eso. Uh, so, and you've got to hear uh, the order of words. The order of words. On a native tongue, you can study language in uh, a textbook, but until you come and walk and talk with the people, you really won't have the language until you have it in your mouth. And very much like the people in the uh, region. So I have on this outfit. It's my airport outfit because I got to get back to the States today, baby. I love going, but I have to get back. So I will be going back today um, at three o'clock. And it was, hola, and it was a blessing to um, be here. And it is a blessing to take off and get back in the friendly skies. All right, guys. Love you. Te amo. Hey guys, I am heading out. We're going to the airport. ¿Cómo se llama? Feliz. Feliz. Ah, hola. Es mi taxista. Es muy guapo, no? Ceci. <laughs> Yay! And we are about to hit that airport because at 3.30, Five, I'm going to be in the skies heading back to the United States. Los Estados Unidos, baby. Okay. And it was such a beautiful day. It was such a beautiful morning. I see. Hey guys, I'm in the airport here in Punta Cana. I finally made it through customs and it was uh, más fácil. It was much easier going back and through customs than it was coming. So, um, I am so, so happy today. I know I'm probably, I say that every time you guys see me, but I am ecstatic today. So I decided on Taco Bell because they had the, more of the freshness that I wanted in the food choices. So, um, I got combo sets and it's um, uh, chalupas and I have um, some papas, but I don't normally eat papas at all. I stop eating potatoes and carrots. But tal vez sometimes, you know, and I'm hungry, my stomach is acting kind of crazy, I have to bow to this food, so this is what I'm having. Got my little condiments here. 
and this is these are my two chalupas and those are my fries and that's my water so I'm going back home guys my visit was stupendous stupendous and I will probably talk about some things later uh, just on different topics and tie in uh, things in my life, the things in the island, things, 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 things. But all everything ever gets down to is todo en la vida es amor. Todo es amor. Todo el mundo. All of the, acerca, uh, alrededor del mundo, around the world, everything is love. Now, it's how you perceive the situation that dictates it be something else, but everything is love. So it is at this time, um, 1.43, so it's Sunday, the 14th of January, and I'm gonna eat this food, be happy, and sell on back on Southwest, which is my airline of choice. Okay guys, I uh, love you so, so much. Te quiero. Adios.